Now that you've got to see a general definition of posture, what is posture as it relates to pain? As we just discussed earlier, that's going to have something to do more with something called kinetic or optimal posture. What is that you say? Let's check it out. What is optimal posture or kinetic alignment? Well, I'm going to show you on the stick figure guy. It's essentially when the ankle, knee, hip, shoulder, and head are all in one line. When this occurs, the muscles in the back of the body and the front of the body are in the proper position and at the proper length to do their job in an optimal way or in a balanced way. It's when we experience imbalance that muscles are overused and underused, which equals pain and dysfunction. So as an example, this is a client of mine that came to me with back pain. And if I draw a line through his kinetic posture, you will see that even though I put it at his ankle or his hip or his shoulder or head, it is not in one line as well as if I take this line and put it on his pelvis and this line and put it at his ribs, it's showing you that he's going to have quite a bit more curvature in his spine between here and here, which puts a lot of pressure in there, which means he's using more back muscles, less stomach muscles, and that in itself, that imbalance, can create pain. It can also create things in the knees, shoulders, head and neck. And as you can see, the biggest tilt is in the pelvis. So no amount of taking and pulling his posture upward or pulling his head back is going to result in the posture that is going to take away pain out of his back.